antioxidants are the secret of immortality. Uh, they really are the secrets of extending lifespan way beyond uh, what we know of today because as we get older, uh, free radicals build up in our body and damage our cells. And there is a uh, process called, uh, originally called the Hayflick limit. Dr. Hayflick determined that cells can divide only maybe 50 times and then they stop dividing. And this usually is about the age 60 in a human being. And so our cells can divide and replicate properly, but when we hit 60 years old around that area, then they aren't able to replicate anymore. We now know that that's controlled by something called telomeres. And telomeres are these uh, little antenna on the ends of, uh, of our genes. And every time our cells divide, they break off. And, and how many telomeres we have is determined by an enzyme called telomerase. And about the age of 12, we stopped making telomerase. The holy grail of medicine is to develop ways of exciting telomerase in the body to increase the longevity of our cells. And one of the things that we discovered is that negative hydrogen is the world's, the universe's most powerful antioxidant. And that antioxidant is the key because there is no other antioxidant in the universe more powerful than negative ionized hydrogen, which is the key to our products. One of the world's foremost experts on antioxidants, Dr. Cutler, has said that your lifespan is directly proportional to the amount of antioxidants you have in your body at any given moment. What happens when we're younger is that we have enzymes in our body called dehydrogenase enzymes. And the purpose of the dehydrogenase is to take oils and carbohydrates in our bodies and remove hydrogen from them in the form of negative ionized hydrogen. And that is the antioxidant that gives us all the electrons that run something called the Krebs cycle, which is the energy cycle of the body. And what happens is we get older, our enzymes systems tend to stop working and we need external sources of negative ionized hydrogen. And that's the secret of our product. Normally, for example, if a person is uh, eating a raw food diet, the raw food diet gives you um, negative ionized hydrogen because what we found out is, is that healthy, raw, organic plants and juices are loaded with negative ionized hydrogen. So if you're on an organic raw food diet, you probably wouldn't need our product because, because you, if you eat that every day, then you're getting negative ionized hydrogen. But most people can't sustain that, especially when you're traveling and so forth. And basically the powerhouses in our cells are called mitochondria. And the mitochondria are little bacteria that live in our cells that produce uh, something called adenosine triphosphate. And the adenosine triphosphate is the, the source of all the energy that runs our body. So, and mitochondria have their own DNA. And the mitochondria in our cells get their DNA from our mothers, not our fathers. And the mitochondria uh, are, are separate bacteria that live in our cells. We feed them and they take care of us by producing adenosine triphosphate or ATP. Now, in a normal human being who's healthy, we manufacture, all our trillions of cells manufacture our body weight in ATP every single day. If you weigh 160 pounds, your cells are manufacturing 160 pounds of ATP every 24 hours to keep you alive. What happens is that as, as any, as um, free radicals attack our cells, they tend to attack the mitochondria. 
and as our mitochondria decrease, we're not making enough H ATP to run our bodies. And so then we tend to age at a much faster rate. So antioxidants are, uh, but not just any antioxidants in the body. We have what's called the antioxidant cascade. The antioxidant cascade means that we have all kinds of antioxidants, everything from vitamin C to pigments found in foods we eat to vitamin E uh, to other antioxidants. Now the thing about antioxidants is that all of these other antioxidants create free radicals when they neutralize a free radical. Now the free radicals they become are not as harmful as the free radicals they've neutralized. Let's take, for example, vitamin C. Vitamin C is called ascorbic acid. But when vitamin C has neutralized a free radical, it becomes what's called dehydroascorbic acid, which means that it's lost a hydrogen. Now, the hydrogen that vitamin C releases is negative ionized hydrogen but one huge vitamin C molecule which is gigantic releases one negative ionized hydrogen per molecule and so what happens is that the vitamin C becomes a free radical not as harmful as what it neutralized but now your body has to get rid of it and so it's harmful to your body but not as bad now, our product, Mega Hydrate, when you take it, it releases negative ionized hydrogen, which can take dehydroascorbic acid and regenerate it back to ascorbic acid, restore the hydrogen. And it does that with every antioxidant in the entire antioxidant cascade in the body. And negative ionized hydrogen, when it's neutralized, is not a free radical. It's the only antioxidant in nature that does not form a free radical when it neutralizes other free radicals. It just forms water, plain old water, which your body eliminates. And so it is the key. There will never ever be found in nature a more powerful antioxidant than megahydrate.